Nigerian government Africans to unleash flu in Nigeria so they can come for their rescue as their messiah in return of their vote come to the election hello great viewers welcome to my noble channel we are will tell you the truth how it is we don't miss words here and in this channel we don't allow liars from government to succeed what is happening today in nigeria flooding everywhere and people like Bo Bonatinibu, Bo Tatiko going to different places to bribe them with several amount of money I call it bribe because they were the ones that unleashed that flood. If you don't know, know it now. Some of you have brain, but you don't use it. Some of you claim you are educated. You started in social university, social university. Some of you claim you came out from Cambridge. Some of you claim you came back from, from Oxford. Some of you claim several things. But believe me, you don't have bread. It's not an insult. It's the fact. You allow these analog criminals that call themselves government. Both the ones that brought Buhari to power. And why we are telling you several years ago which of, of course we are coming to the end of it eight guide them years you refuse to listen why we are telling you that jagaban has nothing good to offer apart from criminality you refuse to listen you betrayed your brothers Debos. you voted for him today you see where we are. Dollar is equal to naira. Now again, they have come again. They started from unleashing fluid to Nigerians, so that poverty people will start crying and asking for help. This is what they have continued to do. They will always use a means to get you and your vote. And as this continue to happen, they will continue to travel to pay you bribe. I call that bribe because if they did not unleash the flooding, they will not come for a rescue. You will ask a question, what is this money for? Then you will know it was a bribe. They are not like men who uses their brain more than you, who call yourself a youth. But you have refused to learn. This government is full of criminality and terrorism. We must set the things the way it is. I am a someone who can never stop until they start changing their ways. Why not ask yourself this question? How can it be coincident? All of a sudden everything was moving fine apart from poverty level of nigerians that this government brought to us all, apart from terrorism and all sort of things now they have come in connection with japan to bring another flooding that is another act of terrorism against the people we should say the things the way it is it's just this way for those of you who has brain but cannot use it Jagaban plan with Buhari government and that thing that calls himself Shetima he is the real planner they plan and go, went somewhere to African country and paid the billions and billions of for them to unleash their fluid to Nigeria 
And believe me, this is what you are suffering today. Those of you that call yourself new Nigerian youth, you have refused to learn from people like us who are the masters. When we tell you this is how it is, this is how it is. I know some of you will start contemplating, saying, Is it true or is it not true? But the fact is, this is just the theft. They unleash fruit to Nigerians. Now they come for your rescue as a messiah. Now they pay you 150 million for flood victims. Now they await your votes come to 2023. And after that, you will suffer for another eight years. And another 16 years because after Tinibu, Shetima is coming. Because that Shetima is the father of all terrorists in Nigeria. This is me, Sax man. I have said it, and that is how it is. Take it or you leave it. We have seen things that states let that change. People no know who they meet does not mean that we are the same. If you believe you are so called in Nigeria and you want to change it now, the youth party is there for you. I don't believe in election. I've said this from the beginning. In fact, I've never voted in my life. But the fact is that I hate it when people try to deceive people because they believe they have the money. Jagaban stole billions of billions of dollars. Apart from being a dog bed peddler, today he is using the billion van he stole from 2015. Why he broke Bahari to power? To mesmerize everybody in Nigeria. He sent his cohort, Chetima, to go somewhere in Africa to do something and unleash fluid. And today he is running to your rescue, giving you 150 million. And you are there clapping. You are going to suffer for 16 years. That 160 million, 50 million given to you, highest you each person get from inside. That, that is if you can even get 5,000 inside in Delta State. And after that, that 5,000 naira, you have sold your soul to the devil. And you will become poor for guide them 16 years. This is what they are planning. I just want to open your eye if you like. Do what you want. But like us, we have always said, this platform is not a platform for election. But I hate it when people try to deceive people. We have told you, <laughs> last time we told you, took, you took it as something today, people are suffering. Businesses are born everywhere in Lagos State. And those businesses are evil businesses. Do you know why? Because Tinibu has found that, that they are not planning to vote for him. That was what he did in 2015 and 2019. We have told you that the best thing is freedom, total freedom. That is what we believe in, people like us. And the best thing to you is to do so. But if you believe you want to exercise your right as a human being, the same thing you can do also when you are asking for freedom. That is left for you. But I've just told you what they are doing. So don't think that the flooding is coincident. No, 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 no. It's not coincident. It's a plan work to get your vote come 2023 election. And it's working. How many times have any of these men who call themselves articulates, tidipus, come to your land and donate money to the poor masses? But now the flood problem has come. They are donating 150 million. This and that. This and that. Just encourage you that they are good people. Brother and sister, wake up from sleep. You are still sleeping. They are the criminals who wants your down for all the days of your life. I think I've come to the end of this news. I've said it before. Whatever I said in my, any of my news, I will take the responsibility when the time comes. And I'll be waiting. Jump, pistol.